basically hanging on by our fingertips for the past eight months, you know, waiting for a break one way or the other to see which way to go. Rich Kramer is like a lot of small business owners trying to stay afloat in the turbulent waters of the pandemic. He's the owner of Richie Rich's downtown deli in Saginaw. With coronavirus cases exploding, he fears another shutdown would lower the boom on his bottom line. I would really have to sit down and take a, a hard look at it to see if it's even worth the effort. Coming in and getting the lights going, getting the ovens on, the refrigerators, ordering all the product to sit here and wait on a maybe. Meanwhile, Wendy Siebert, the owner of Candlelight Sports and Banquet Center in Bridgeport, says if there is a shutdown, leave bowling centers out of it. If we're following everything that's been laid out and we're complying and we've been audited to that, I don't know why as a single industry that we would be targeted to close down. Siebert tells us bowling leagues are in full swing. And if the pins stop falling, Siebert says her business could end up in the gutter. This is our revenue stream. You know, we were able to make it first through the first six months shutdown, but we, we need to stay open. Governor Gretchen Whitmer did not issue any restrictions today, but alarming COVID-19 numbers are setting the stage for an uncertain future. And Kramer wonders how many of his fellow business owners will make it to the other side. Thousands and thousands of us are out here hanging paycheck to paycheck now during this pandemic. And now we're looking at another downturn, and I just don't know who's going to survive it. Reporting in Saginaw County, James Felton, WNEM TV5.